With every passing week, it's become a trend that the guys at Epic Games keep releasing amazing, amazing news content of things that they've made and things that they're about to make. And today we have news coming from the guys at Epic Games and it has to do with Unreal Engine 4.23 Preview 1. It is now available and it simply means that if you want to try this tool out, you can now go over to your Epic Games launcher and you can get a copy of this tool for free and you can go ahead and try this. Some of the key things that you can find with this preview are things that we made mention of at the GDC that ended not so long ago. Some of the other things that you can find are also improvements and significant stuff that they've gone ahead to implement with the recent version of Unreal Engine. And if you've been taking a look at the updates which we've been releasing, there's a time where they said that they now have support for HoloLens. One of the features here says that there is significant improvement to the Nikigara workflow and many editor updates, HoloLens 2 support and more. More things simply include things like the editor updates, the audio updates, there's also animation updates. I'm going to put a link where you can find all of these things in the forum and so that you can read these things out for yourself. There's also updates to physics, which has to do with chaos and destruction. And there is also geometry fracturing that's going to be included. You can now cache simulations and, you know, you can have them directly in your scene. There's also a sequence update, which gets to do with the sequencer that exists directly there in Unreal Engine. Within the animation update, there is now a new skin way profile that is available and this would actually enable you to override the original skin that has been painted somewhere else and you know that has been stored in the skeleton of the mesh so take for example that if you make a model directly in Maya or let's say 3d max or blender you can now override that particular skin weight and you know make new changes to it from this website here it says please keep in mind that these previews are intended only to provide a sample of what's going to be released in the update and they are not production ready for you to get unreal you can go over to the library and directly from the launcher you'll be able to simply download the unreal engine 4.23 zero preview one and link to where you can find all of these things which i've talked about in the blog is going to be available so you can go through read these things up for yourself and get informed there's also updates for virtual production which gets to do with you being able to use the virtual camera that has been implemented directly in unreal you can now use those stuff directly there there's also things that you can use for scouting which has to do with vr some of the updates which i'm very excited for within this new release is things that has to do with the animation the simulation itself the editor and finally the fact that they have made some significant improvement within the sequencer but then if this is something that you find appealing you can go ahead and try this thing out there's also going to be significant updates with blueprint for sure so i would like to know what you guys think about this in the comment section and if you like this video you know what to do go ahead and hit the like button and turn on notification and if you're new here it's going to be amazing if you can hit the subscribe button and also turn on notifications so you don't miss the next video and until i see you guys again with a tutorial update free friday tutorial tuesday tips and tricks things like this peace